The newly formed Evansville Regional Economic Partnership, or EREP, will now take the lead on advancing business interests for the Evansville region. But what does this all mean? Well, Eyewitness News' Ryan Whitry is live at 5 from Main Street in Evansville. Ryan, what can you tell us? Well, first off, Brad and Shelley, three names are going away. The Economic Development Coalition of Southwest Indiana, the Growth Alliance of Greater Evansville, and the Southwest, uh, Southwest Indiana Chamber are merging to form one group called EREP. Now, several local leaders tell me that un uniting these different agencies will give the Evansville area a better and more unified voice. With the cutting of a ribbon, the EREP is now here. It will have two CEOs, Tara Barney from the Southwest Indiana Chamber and Greg Wathen from the Economic Development Coalition. We wanted to take advantage of that being the Evansville name, regional. We really wanted to focus on the regional side of it because we work within a regional market, which we've done. Partnership, we're bringing all these organizations together and partnering to provide value for the broader region. New EREP chairman Jim Ryan says the time was right to merge. Time is moving so fast right now, and we understood that we would be better together having one message, one website, one voice out there uh, working on these really important initiatives we thought was better uh, for our region. Evansville Mayor Lloyd Winicky served on two of the boards that merged into EREP. Combining these three organizations will give Southwest Indiana, the Evansville region, a, a broader, louder voice to all over Indiana and literally all over the world. Now, Indiana Lieutenant Governor and Evansville native Susanna Crouch will be in town next week to meet with EREP leaders. But for now, live at 5, reporting from downtown Evansville, Brian Wittry, Eyewitness News.